There's a pole right here. All right, Coach, um, regular season sweep over Abilene Christian today. Um, struggling game. Well, so, um, mid-February, every game gets to be a little bit more intense, a little bit more uh, highly contested. I think everybody knows everybody's plays right now, so we call out a play, they run to the spot. Um, and so you have to go make plays. And I was very proud of the fact that we made some plays today. Uh, Lex played 20 minutes and had 14 points, I think. you know, So that's, that's pretty good when you can go out there and get that done in a half a game. Um, Alicia backed up her double-double from earlier this week and, and uh, went and got a six rebounds and double-digit points. And you know, uh, Delicia Booth played very well and, and did a really good job for us. Emma Young got some things, uh, made some big-time plays. Day Day Evans is running the show. Uh, uh, you know, everybody, Tierra Matthews comes off the bench, gets his three offensive rebounds. So it's a team concept. Everybody's making a difference. Very proud of, of our effort today. Yeah, Leeson, uh, second game for you, getting double figures scoring, and you also are tied for the team lead with six, six rebounds. Against, um, you know, two of the top opponents in SFA and, and Abilene Christian in this conference, you know, what's been, you know, what's been working well for you kind of against those two teams? Uh, I think I just have to focus on what I'm doing and not worry about the opponent. And I just have to come out there and do what I can do, because I know I can do it. Um, Lex, for you, um, you know, same thing, you need the team this morning with, with, with 16. Um, you know, what was working well for you overall today? Definitely my whole team was working for me. Like, they would penetrate, kick it out, or dish it off to me. So I really got a shout out to all my teammates for helping me out with that. Also, um, second game, 58 points this game, 59 points last game against, you know, the top scoring offense in the, in the league. You know, talk about kind of the, the defensive mindset going into this game against a high power offense. I feel like our defense leads to offense. Like defense, we make good plays on defense. So just practicing hard and working on our defense, no matter who the opponent is, as long as we focus on defense and communicate and talk, we could beat anybody in this league. Coach, coming off that tough loss to SFA last uh, Saturday, you know, what, what was kind of the mindset coming into this game to come and get that bounce back win? Well, I, I think a lot of times people don't give student athletes enough credit because this is their week. We traveled to Nacogdoches on Tuesday, spent all day, six hours, seven hours on a bus, played a game Wednesday night, got on that bus, got in here about 3.30 in the morning. By the time they got to bed, it was 4 o'clock in the morning. Uh, got up on Thursday. We had a team meeting at 9 a.m. They went to class all day. Then we had our practice on Friday, and they came in here and played a game at noon. So, you know, when you, you think about the sacrifice sacrifices that these young people make, um, they are they're just next level. And for us to be able to bounce back and, and show the grit and intensity to play these kind of games, uh, that's what you have to do in Katy. Uh, there are no, no easy ones in Katy. It's going to be you got to play the best team in the league, then you play the next best team in the league and the next best team. And so that's what it takes to be a uh, championship team. And, and so we're getting those opportunities to show we're capable. Thank you. Thank you.